hey, welcome to the channel. How do I say a? Hey. Hello, welcome to the channel. I'm Seth, and this is the fourth episode of season one of The Leftovers entitled BJ and the AC. Last episode was extremely Matt centric, so I, if we do see him in this episode, I expect he'll just be running around in the background screaming or do something irrational or just be pissed off. Uh, at the GR, <laughs> especially. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know where or when we're gonna go with this episode. I just know it's not gonna be centered on Matt. So I guess we'll find out. All right, let's keep it short and sweet and get into it. So here we go. Season four, episode. Season four. Whoa. Season one, episode four, of the leftovers. Here we go. Are we making? Okay. I'm glad I didn't say what I thought we were making, because that would have made this very weird. Are these drug babies, like they fell them up with cocaina? Is this how the GR makes money? Are we finally seeing, like, where they're getting money from? Like, what do they do? Is it gone, or is it still there? What the f I think it was gone, like, many frames ago. <laughs> The baby wrapped up is kind of like the statue that the guy made at the Hero Day, right? You want something to drink? Water? Coffee? Drano? Don't do that. Library. Don't do that to me, dude. I want to ask you a favor. Yeah. <laughs> give us a little break. Tomorrow. You come, I'm not gonna protect you. It's the holidays. It's the perfect time to ruffle their feathers. <laughs> what would yeah, what was she like in return? I thought maybe he'd throw a picture of his wife down to uh yeah to shit on him. Energy. Oh, it looks like somebody stole the baby from the nativity. You know, Jesus. Am I supposed to give a shit? Uh, wow. No. That's why you're punished by God. Yo, Tommy's phone. Oh, right, right. What the fuck, Tommy? Wayne broke it. It's been six fucking weeks, Christine. I think we fucking need him to. Yo, call. Yeah, just on your own. Why are you in my dream? It was not hey, ex... Christine? It was not ex... Do you know this guy? I, I talked to him, him a couple of times. <laughs> You're just walking out with your dick out, choking people. Somebody hit him in the face with a something. Thank you. A fist. Another fist. Oh, they're stopping him, not the fucking naked guy choking out a girl. I feel so strange. Everything about that felt so off. Jody is the sister, and Allison is the friend. Amy, Abby, some shit. I got like a gas bubble in my chest. Look for the others when I get Not my chest, but tonight, okay? that'd be bad. But yeah, this goes to my heart. I'll oh, die on brother. camera. That'd be really bad. This baby had just vanished from the manger. <laughs> Why are people giving a shit? Yeah. You can't just get a new one. It's sacred. It's a symbol that you bought from the store. Jill, did you steal the baby Jesus? Jill, that's what it is. That's sick. It is sick. <laughs> you enjoying my sandwich? She's being very sexual with her sandwich eating and her eye line. I don't know, maybe that wasn't the right word, but she was there's there is a little intensity there and I don't I don't trust it. Especially with the dream that he had. With her in the bedroom with him. Baby boy, twenty inches. <laughs> the white one. Obviously, the fucking white one, Marlene. Fuck. Goodbye. Did you know somebody? Send your aide to go get baby Here's Jesus. What you're gonna do. Get the fucking baby. Open the box. Strip it naked. Scruff it up. You can say you found it in a ditch or a dumpster or something. Because you need a win, Kevin. What? People already think he's fucking killing dogs, and now you want someone to see him fucking up baby Jesus? 
he was talking about a waste of resources, but he's a chief of police going out to get fucking to get a baby Jesus. Yes, Dennis. I am. He doesn't want to buy a new one. I don't know if he's your. He's refusing to buy a new one, or or he'd rather do his job, or. So the creator can find us, you know, for next. Hey, good luck with that. Shh. From now on, you keep your fucking mouth shut. Okay. Not a fucking word. Trying to sound like Wayne, you you don't sell it as well. Uh, uh, Looked at her, him like 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 he he hit her. (laughs) So you haven't. Oh shh. Shit. Stay put, okay? Yeah, stay put, and then that fucking stink eye on the way out. Y'all better dip. Who is it that? Di- oh. I've got security video. Of one of the suspects was wearing a hoodie. Everyone's got a hoodie. Fuck off. I almost wore mine. You know. A little unofficial. What do you think? Uh. Your dad already knows you took it. Did you tell him I took it? No. They could have just bought one from the store, but, you know, but that wouldn't have been as cool. Whatever. It wasn't. It wasn't really sick until the singing. Now it's kind of sick. <laughs> hmm. So her choice not to shoot. Oh shit. Oh shit. Is that? Wait. I was gonna say that's not Lori. Oh. Shit, yeah, blank. Clever. You have to let me know why. Because she's a fucking, like, concubine of his, and she's pregnant. I want to go home. With his baby? That's why. Yo, what the fuck? He was just about to give up. Potential. Your potential. You want to come in the house? Does she only get... Yes, thank you. Does she only get paid for... Episodes that she speaks in because she hasn't gotten paid yet. Kevin, I can't say this to you, but I won't just slip it under the door and run away. I won't insult you, Kevin, by saying that this well, is Please stop talking, just for a second. There is no family, is what the it's lady said friend. earlier. It's in the envelope. Divorce papers, there is no family. She had to stop What's in the envelope? This is a maneuver. The world changed. Shut Kevin. the fuck up! Was this a tactical move by the GR, like, waiting till now to file that? Yep. Fucking say it! You fucking say it, Lori! <sighs> it's for you. Don't forget me. Well, I do smoke a lot. She'll have... Oh, and then you got leverage on her. You're not friends. You're not building trust. You're taking advantage. Whore. Is she... Yo, Lori is in. Did he join some cult, or is he, like, in disguise as one of them to not be noticed? How'd you end up like this, kid? My dad was... was abandoned by my father. <laughs> He's like, well, there you go. I knew it. What's that for? It'll make you invisible. So the creator can find us. So they say. So they claim. Oh, dude, you gotta put your fucking sheet on there. How much did you hear last night? (laughs) Fucking say it, Lori. (laughs) Why is she here? She's already pieced it together. It's complicated. Let me know when it gets simple. <laughs> the baby Jesus returned. I found him. Yeah, he told the boys if if it shows up, no problem. Why the fuck is she talking to anyone? You're supposed to be laying low and staying safe and away from fucking people. Tom, this is Tom. How about your Tommy? (laughs) 
Stop checking her out, you fucking guy. Is this a stage sit down or are these body bags? What are we? Are these people from fucking that disappeared? Are they? Oh, it's got stickers on it from a funeral home. Like, what's going on? All right, so is the GR going to show up? We'll see. Come on up here, Kevin. Say hello. Oh, and baby Jesus was returned. Thank you so much, Chief Garvey. Oh. Also, I know oh, he has it with him. Right, right. Worried about this little guy, uh, but we found him safe and sound. <clears throat> There's that. Thank you, Chief Garvey. See, we're lucky to have you. See, 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 no one really fucking cared. It was just the daughter lashing out and the mayor thinking that people cared. Oh, right, that she is distraught after Matt set her up, said the husband was cheating. I just found out he cheated on me. God damn it. I cheated on my wife. There it is. That's immediate trust that just opened up to her and we're like, oh, I cheated. Have a good night. Even though isn't her brother Matt and Matt and Kevin go back, so like, doesn't why doesn't she know him? I don't get that. Are they role playing that they don't know each other? I don't understand. Can't touch him. Huh, five yards back, whatever. You know, I actually started to worry that you might be a human being for once and not show up. <laughs> if she didn't trespass, this is wrongful arrest and it'll backfire. She gonna say something? She looks like she wants to. Almost. Dude, trap guard activated. This was a decoy. They're doing big shit. I, I don't know what's going on here and it bothers me. It's gonna be a mass arson event? Like, what are they doing? Are they really just like breaking into? Oh, they are. Everyone's out of the party, so they're taking their fucking, stealing their pictures, or are they just blanking them or turning them around? What are they doing? This is breaking an enemy, right? That could be some form of domestic terrorism if you're trying to influence or persuade by force or coercion or the use of force or intimidation. Yeah, what's Matt going to do with all that money? I didn't even think about that from last episode. He, like, took it to the bank, but it was too late because he had been at the hospital. Deep web and get some artillery and blow up his own church. I heard the baby went missing. I had a spare. Yeah, that's like, uh, from the intro. It's like a cherub. Oh, back to that lighter. Yeah, all these people got their real shit stolen. I don't care about the symbol. <laughs> Alright. So Alright. So that was the episode. Tom and Christine on the run. Naked guy attacked her. She's pregnant with Wayne's baby. Broke her out of the maternity ward by sneaking her out as one of those people and uh yeah he got a call but it was like a gr phone call or some religious based phone call i, I wasn't exactly sure but i'll check it now when i go back and edit I'll, I'll know for sure what it was all about yeah Lori showing up to give divorce papers to kevin that didn't go well the fact that Lori was going for the lighter at the end, don't forget me, and was reaching for the lighter. I don't know if she's going to get the lighter or not, or if it, it's, it's, or if she'll end up with it, or if it's more symbolic of her not actually being able to get it. And it's like, don't forget me. And that, that divide, maybe that echoes what's, uh, between her and her family. Because even if she's mad at her husband for cheating, I'm assuming she knows about that. Um, her relationship with her daughter and her, her son would be something completely different. Yeah, uh, baby Jesus. <laughs> the symbolic, it's a big problem and no one really cared to waste the resources and then he did it and it was like no one, no one ultimately really cared except his daughter. Seemed happy, but maybe that was just misdirection on her part to hide the fact that she did it or knew something about it being taken. 
Yeah, the GR has been relatively peaceful and not really law breaking, but now they're <laughs> now they have, and I, there's going to have to be proof of that. There's going to have to be home security footage, parking lot footage, uh, street corners, cars. There's going to be there's going to be documentation of all these people in white going in. So. Unless it's not breaking and entering if they went into houses of places that they used to live or family thereof, then it might not be breaking and entering. That would be something too. Um even though I didn't even though Matt did poke in at the end of the episode, I really thought he would be planning something against the GR or doing something with the money, but he was just like, Well, if I've got another Jesus. <laughs> so don't know. I'm assuming he's still furious with the GR. Don't know what he's going to do with the money. I'm interested to know, but that'll have to be in another episode. This is going to do it for me for now. It's 8 in the morning. I've been filming for a little while now, a couple hours. I'm going to take a break. Thank you all so much for being here and spending your time. Hope you enjoyed, and I look forward to the next one, and I hope to see you there. Goodbye.